I was out walking this morning when I saw something in this pack rat trap. When I looked closer, I saw that it was a Gila monster. I knew I had to get him out of there, so I called my friends Keith and Petra to see if they'd be willing to come and help out. And as usual, they were. I also wanted to mention that my walking friends, Sherry and Tom, happened by while this was occurring, and so they got to witness it. Okay, guys, I hope you can see in there. This is a pack rat trap. And there's a Gila monster in there. Hang on. Okay, guys, that was just Petra. She was letting me know that she'll be here in just a few minutes. And uh, we're going to try to get this trap open and let this uh, Gila monster out. I know people try to catch pack rats and all that. And I'm glad this wasn't a, a fatal trap, you know, a snap trap or something. These are called have a heart traps because they live capture. And uh, at least we'll have a chance to let this guy go. Now, I'm not trying to upset him or anything, but when we try to open that door, he might start hissing and stuff, I don't know. But uh, I've got a long garden tool that I'm gonna try to open that door with and I'm hoping he'll just shoot out and go right back down that hole. So anyway, Pete will be here shortly and uh, we'll get underway. Oh, okay. You, are you running? Yeah. Okay guys, we're gonna try to lift the Opening with this big break thing. Oh, I gotta. You have to push this thing over. Hmm. Pull the trap over this way. Well, I can. You can see he's moving. I don't think he's too happy. I don't want him to attack me, but you gotta push this button over to raise the door. Buddy, we're trying to help, okay? So please don't hurt me. Okay. Come on, little guy. Okay, go out. You're free. See if he'll come out. I'll try to encourage him a little bit. Come on. Come on. Come on, buddy. Come on. Go out. He's hanging on. Maybe we just wait a second and see what he does afraid of us. Come on. And he could be cold. Come on, buddy. Lift it all the way up. He'll slide out. Oh, it's all the way up. He can definitely get out. What do you say we pause? and step away and see if he'll go out. Let's go. Go? Come on. Go out. Keep going. There you go. Maybe he'll slowly take a step or two. He's starting to go. He's holding on. You can see his little claws holding on. He's got a good grip in there. Hold it there, he'll go. He's at least stretched out now. He's got a... I should, I'm gonna move it. Oops, sorry. You can even pick it up, Bart. I know, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put him up here so it's kind of angled down. See? See right there. Look at that guy. Yeah. <laughs> it's the first time I've been that close to a Gila monster. Turn it the other way. 
He's got, uh, well, he did. He had something on his tail. And we'll see movement. Okay, the door's all the way off. And he'll have sun on him in just a minute. Yeah, yeah. Come on, buddy. Come on, your hole's right there. He's not caught anywhere, is he? No. He moved a little bit. Rescue mission is about to be complete. other side. There he comes. Okay, here's the deal. I'm going to go up and around from the top. I'm going to back up just a little bit. Or it's going to go around the other side to try and see if it can get him to come out. Oh, this is a bad spot. There's nasty stickers right here. Be careful. Front foot's out. Keep going, buddy. Wondering if you can pull the back of the cage just back a little. I can try it. It's just a bad spot. There's stickers and shit everywhere. His tongue is working. Yes. And I don't want to accidentally drop the cage down the hill. We don't want you to. <laughs> oh, let me see what I can do. I, the thing that bothers me is he's coming out towards me. No, I think he won't have Be careful so you don't slide. I'm getting stabbed all by all these trees. Oh, this is nasty. 
Hey, Keith. Yeah. Hun. Would you be willing to come up and hold this out of the way? Right here, bud. Be ready to move in case he comes out. I think he's kind of cold. He doesn't want to attack me. So where my fingers are right here, there's no stickers. Right there. Ooh. Right here. Right there. Grab. Almost, little guy. Hey. There we go. Oh, cool. Okay. There we go. Get the hell out of here. <laughs> Look at how beautiful he is. Okay guys, he's out of the cage. He's just laying there. The sun will be on him in a, a little while. He probably just needs to warm up. He might have been in there all night. Got a little cold. Although it only got down to about, what, 77? Anyway, he's free and I'll cruise by later and see how he's doing if he's gone. Thanks for watching. Okay. He's taking a couple of steps and he's moving around a little bit now that he's gotten out of the cage. So we're going to step away and leave him alone. Boy, he's a beautiful one. Look at that. I don't know. I'll have to look at my other video and look at the tail, but he could be the other one I saw just a couple of days ago. It's in the same area. Look at that tongue going. There he goes. Well, I'd say he's at least 16, possibly more. Back out a little bit here. Is he going towards this hole? Yes. Yeah, maybe he's going to go Slowly. back in his den. He goes. He's going in his hole. Oh, thank God. I was worried about him. All right, buddy. Be careful out there.